Okay, so I've just got back from a ride. Uh, I haven't really been on a, a training ride for quite a long time. Uh, I've uh, sort of thought lockdown, coronavirus and everything, maybe time to have a bit of time off and that, that degenerates into becoming unfit and training less and so on and so forth and seeing other people's pictures of them training loads and oh it's great we've been able to get out of the bike oh it's been brilliant lockdown oh it's amazing and um uh and, and rather less so over here so i was out on my ride and i thought well maybe to inspire me to do a bit more bit more training and get back on it um and also to intersperse the uh tales of of, of epic gravel rides into the sunset and, uh, uh, and everybody having fun in lockdown. I, I could intersperse into that, uh, my little vlog of misery. Um, but uh, hopefully it's not all misery because this is a, this is a positive, uh, going out on a training ride and, uh, and, and aiming to get fit. And um, I thought I'd do this because we're just hitting another, another lockdown and, uh, but maybe there's some light at the end of the tunnel and there could be a national championships in cyclocross. Uh, spring is just around the corner and, and maybe I should put in a, a bit of effort and get fit. So um, I haven't, it's not really planned this, I haven't even got my uh, my, my backdrop sorted or anything like that. Um, I, I hang some jerseys up here and some chain rings and things in the future perhaps. But um, uh, anyhow, so the idea is to really short little snippets of uh, not just how I'm getting on with my training because I have a very low expectations of my ability to stick with it at the moment but who knows i might be able to do that uh but um throwing another few bits and pieces in there about um ad advice for other people training skills tech that kind of thing and so people aren't looking at me all the time maybe even get a few guests on you can see i've thought this all through in the two hour ride that i've just been on which is about as much as i can manage at the moment um so I've, I've done myself a little training program. Uh, I can I put that up on screen. And uh, it's, uh, it's, it's one week long at the moment. Um, it's starting off pretty easy. I've decided I'm going to do a power test on Friday. Uh, I haven't done one of those for quite a long time. And I imagine it'll be awful. Uh, but uh, then, we, then we can start to, to move on from there. You don't have to do a power test if you're training. Um, it's just something to you know really make you feel bad if you have got a power meter plenty of other ways you can do these things um, but as I move on from this week and this um, little foray into training I'll start to put in a few more bits and pieces about um, what I'm doing to to build up for who knows what and I think that's uh, an important thing about training at the moment and enjoying riding your bike you can't necessarily train for a target because your target might not be there um, so you need to intersperse with with training, uh, you know, having fun on your bike because that's what we're all here for, and also be flexible about uh, what you might be training for. So is it going to be the national championships in January? Um, is it going to be a bit of cyclocross in February, moving into March, or is it just so that we start the uh, the spring feeling fit um, for you know when we've got a vaccine and we're all racing again? So we'll we'll see. So you know, it's it's just training really. Um, but it's not just about training, uh, it, it's about the, the lifestyle as well, isn't it? I, I mean, there are two sorts of people who went into lockdown, those who stopped drinking and those who started drinking, I suppose. I'm, I'm more on the started drinking kind of thing, so I'll, I'll be trying to cut down on that a bit as well and, and improving the diet. Uh, I think I'm a bit of an all or nothing sort of person. Um, if I'm not training, I'm not fit, what's the point of looking after myself? You know, uh, there's, there's, uh, there's, there's, there's no point, but that's not really the case, is it? So. I'm going to um, I maybe even throw in a few recipes uh, and, a, and, and a few ideas as to how you might um, might improve the old health. I think the key thing though is, isn't it Frank Sinatra saying he, he feels sorry for those who don't drink because um, uh, when they get up in the morning that's going to be the best they'll feel all day. And I suppose if you don't drink and you start training, well you haven't got that to, to benefit from. I know. Um, if I, if not that I've been drinking a heck of a lot, but if, if I cut down on a beer or, uh, or two uh, every so often, suddenly the weight will start to fall off me, but, um, and, and I'll suddenly start to get a bit faster. But if you're not drinking already, sorry, you, you haven't got this to look forward to. Um, 
uh, what else are we going to do? Uh, we'll look at some skills, uh, so we can get out of this 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 dark cave I'm in. Uh, we'll we'll get out into the woods and uh, and and do some uh, some running around and jumping and things like that. Might even get my kids to uh, help me out a bit there because my bunny hopping's not the best. Uh, and um, what else? We'll um, try to solidify this a little bit uh, on a, on a companion blog. So you're not just uh, you're not just looking at my face. You can you can read a little bit about it as well. Um, anyway, um, hopefully we'll get a few views, uh, a few people coming on, uh, generate a little bit of interest, and show you all that uh, lockdown isn't just about happiness and showing off about it on social media. It's uh, it's a little bit about misery and struggling through, uh, and um, you can you can watch me do that. So um, uh, I said I'll keep it short and sweet. Uh, if you want to spend hours on YouTube, there's plenty of other things you can do. Um, so yeah, anyway, uh, take care. I hope I do post this. I've just recorded it. Uh, I've still got to put it up on a channel, uh, but um, hopefully you'll see it there and you'll stick with me and you'll watch the next episode when uh, I might even do it just after I've finished my power test and you can see how woefully inadequate I am power-wise. Okay, take care.